Hello, everyone. I'm Gao Yang from the Hong Kong Polytechnic University. Today, I'm very happy to share one of recent studies. Asymmetric elastoplasticity of stacked graphene assembly actualizes programmable and tethered soft robotics. Soft actuators can transfer external stimulus such as heat, light, moisture, and electricity into mechanical deformations. So, they have great potential in developing artificial muscles and flexible robotics. How to construct an untethered actuation system with high actuation performance and high programmability in a faster way is still a grand challenge nowadays. To overcome these difficulties, we develop a stacked graphene assembly polyethylene bilayer material, which is fabricated by transferring stacked graphene flakes onto PE film via non-mirror blowjet technique. An SGAPE bilayer film is obtained after drying in nitrogen gas at room temperature. As prepared, SGAPE bilayer delivers a bending and a curling into a row when heated, and SGA is wrapped inside. This is easy to understand as the thermal expansion coefficient of graphene is negligible compared with PE. Interestingly, if the SGAPE bilayer is subject to heating and subsequent cooling in a constrained space, it will coil into a row after removing the constraint at room temperature. Especially, the PE layer is wrapped inside, which is oxide to the sample without tempering. If heated, it can return to a flat state. We found this abnormal thermal-induced morphing behaviors is due to the asymmetric elastoplastic properties of SGA. Particularly, SGA exhibits high plasticity and tension due to irreversible sliding between the graphene flakes. In contrast, under compression, SGA exhibits reversible ripple-like deformation. Therefore, after undergoing a constrained tempering process, there is residual compressive stress in SGA but residual tensile stress in PE. It leads to the curling with PE wrapped inside after removing the constraint. This asymmetric elastoplastic behavior of SGA enables us to program the initial configuration of the SGA PE-based morphing system, like patterned SGA patches, non-uniform SGA thickness, localized tempering, laser writing, and so on. And then the bilayer units with different shapes can be assembled to produce more complicated soft actuators, for example, a sit-up robot. The robot, assembled from folded units, can sit up under IR light illumination. The second example is artificial iris. It mimics the closure of iris after exposing to IR light. We also fabricated artificial water lily. It's initially in bud and blooms in less than two seconds upon exposure to sunlight. More interestingly, the SGAPE by material curling into a row can achieve rolling locomotion under lateral infrared lighting, yielding an untethered light-driven motor. The propulsive force is attributed to the unfolding of outermost layer under heating and then interaction with the ground. This kind of SGAPE light-driven motor is showcased to push a football into a goal. If you are interested in this work, you can find more detailed information from our paper. Also, you can visit our homepage for more information of our group. Thank you for watching. See you.